Motherfuckers over there, like, you feel me? Come on. Young nigga getting money, now he's sick. They can't get response back, bitch, go suck a dick. What's good, YouTube? This one's great, and I'm back in the reaction. I just feel me, I look. Pete, I have catch you. We have a reaction to a song about, you feel me, about YSGs in a minute, but you feel me? He just dropped a song featuring AB the Jet, Nestle Fox, and Scotty Tupati. It's called African, I think it's called African Killers, if I'm not mistaken. What did it say? Oh, bro, I think it's, I think it's African Killers. We go, we go, we go, we go. It's African something on the front you feel me? We finna react to the song, see what's too. I haven't heard any songs about it in a minute. They as I have been keeping up with them no more. Every single day I go on YouTube, it's like his ass on Instagram tweaking. Yelling on like you for me on live screen like always into it all you for me he he be in the mix on funnel so you for me I think this song will have a lot of sad type shit he always come with that he always come with that pressure on funnel we finna see what's to the song any huge fans any one of the names I mentioned let them comments down below which I saw out of ten you for me uh who y'all thought was the hardest uh any songs better I should listen to for me leave the autumn comments down below what's your opinions towards wise G type shit what's going on out there you for me like I said I've I've been peeping. The shit like I buy him only been tuned in for for y'all y'all gotta be peeking. Let me know what's going on front of uh other than that new channel first time see me won't be your last time so we're not that shit I'm the always up on game up on up on up on the TV sub continue to support whatever every single day every single day all day love appreciate everybody's been liking comments and reposting that post notification on this already sub channel love appreciate y'all for real I would not be doing shit without y'all other than that we finna hop straight into the video right now. Talk about what it kind of have on because you there's motherfuckers in every single song. Yeah. 
I thought that was the full, like a full song type shit, but Pete, you feel me? The song, I uh, thought the song most definitely was decent on front of like, I'm gonna go ahead and give it, if my honest opinion right now is like 8 out of 10, we're gonna have to go back over again, see what my uh, full, honest, and true feelings towards it, you feel me? Um, let me know in the comments down, in the comments down below, what do you rate the song of 10, was our favorite verse, favorite line, all the comments down below, you feel me? What was our favorite verse, favorite line, who I thought was the hardest? Um... I, it's actually matter of fact, it's like two parts. I really want to hear. I want to hear uh, Lion G's part and this uh, Scotty uh, catch because they kind of when they kind of Scotty for Scotty asses and, and like everybody fucking say something about him every single song, every single song. You feel me? It's, his name is mentioned. I, I, you, I would never, you would never forget his name. Touch on his name. <laughs> but I want to go over Lion G's part and Scotty's part on front of, and I'm gonna get, I'm gonna tell y'all. Cause I feel like they had the hardest parts in my opinion. I feel like they was going the hardest, the coldest. I'm gonna uh, go over there too far and see who I feel like who out of the two went the hardest. Let me know in the comments down below. Like I said, who y'all thought was the hardest on the song? Other than that's how I tried to do it. Okay, this was this is the A A B. -A. He said back though. Wait, hold on. You hold on. Oh, we missed Scotty Part Sword. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me know what happened. Hey, what happened? She got touched. Well, what happened, folks? That's after she catch my up. Hey, this day, this is one of the big two, bro. You feel me? And then like every I told y'all when I listen to his music, he he just give that shit like he he's on time in every single song, bro. Like anytime I hear his name get brought up, he's on time and on front of he's always on time and has never not been on time for every single time I see his shit, he's on time. And then people ain't start the song off like they they waste no time off rip, like what? Doc got me laced. He shot him slightly. You feel me? Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Funnel. Like, but off rip, like, damn, you feel sure, like. And I still, I still have my, I still feel like the same way. Like, I see, I feel like it's crazy to have Funnel last one out. That shit bogus. <laughs> Hey, for like I said, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna give matter of fact, I'm gonna bump my reaction up to rate it. It's like a nine out of ten. Let me the comments down below. What y'all rate this song out of ten? You feel me? New to channel, first time seeing you have not said it, bro. This is not a plot for those who have not. That's already, you feel me? That's already sub. You already sub, you know what's going on, type shit. But if you've been watching my videos for a minute and it's your first time seeing me, I'm gonna tell you some valuable ass information like that. I feel like you should go about your life with when it comes to being on YouTube, type shit. I'm from them. Especially when it comes to being on my channel, you feel me? <clears throat> If you watch this video towards the end of the video, and you watch my videos for a minute, and you not said it, and you feel me, <clears throat> your first time seeing it. If your first time seeing it, go ahead and sell it, you feel me? But if you watch my videos for a minute, and you have not said it every day, and you just return to the viewer, and it's not said, you do understand that you wasting minutes of time of your life. This video is about like eight, nine minutes. That means you just wasted eight, nine minutes of your life. 
And that kind of goes for the ones that's already not sub. Like I said, if you're not sub, this kind of really goes for you too, you feel me? But just for those that's new, you feel me? It's not really too much hate. Go ahead and sub. It's, and it's not even hate. I'm fine, it's not even hate. It's not really much of an issue towards you to feel like that when it comes to that front of it. It's just like, I gotta let it be known. I'm like, this is what you're doing. I can't let y'all be wasting y'all time. Because you understand it's like eight, nine minutes of life that you have just wasted and that you could not get back in. You can't, I'm fine, you just realize this shit. You can't, like, oh, shouldn't go get that time back and me stop and rewind. You can't do that. You could, that shit still moving. I'm fine. You just wasted eight, nine minutes. So you just gave me time of your life. I'm fine. And you're not seven. You're not waiting. You understand? You're not wasting my time. Because you gave me your time. I'm fine. And you watching the video. And you gave me my watch. I was my watch minutes. I'm fine. I'm getting my support, bro. You like, you You can't waste your time. I'm going to tell you this right now. You feel me? Make that shit work for a while and go ahead and sell it to my channel. I'm telling you, sell it because you will see me again. It's no point of it. You're going to continue seeing me. Ask anybody that's already thought to my channel. They thought they were going to see just one video or a couple videos and going to be it. No, we don't rock like that. We're not moving like that over there. You're going to see one video and continue seeing videos come out of me. We not no regular YouTubers when it comes to the shit. Just continue sub and continue showing support. Going up every single day. It's every single day on Debbie. Other than that, I'm not going to hold you so much longer. Catch the members. Great. Out.